The cloud, mobility, social media, big data. There is an imperative today for all organizations, large and small, to leverage these new technologies, together known as the third platform, to increase expansion and continue to compete. The term digital transformation, or DX then, describes this process of embracing the potential expansion and competitiveness offered by the third platform. The competitive advantages found in digital transformation have been and continue to be profound. Think Uber, the taxi giant that owns no cars, or Airbnb, the accommodation giant that owns no property. And DX is likely to consume the discussion in every boardroom over the next several years drastically changing the relationship between the board and the IT function because the board's ability to expand and compete will increasingly become reliant on the talent, discipline and capability of its software teams. This, in turn, requires new approaches to IT governance, viewing IT as a service business, creating and leveraging internal and external cloud source services in the pursuit of added value. The Open Group's recently launched standard for IT governance, IT for IT, is a notable contribution to this effort. It's relevant to any company focused on managing the business of IT, and especially those with an interest in business and IT transformation. IT for IT aims to allow the IT function within an organization to achieve the same level of business discipline, predictability, and efficiency as other functions in the business. An initiative such as IT for IT requires software tool support. The iServer repository from Orbis supports enterprise architecture and business process analysis as part of its unified platform for business and IT transformation, and it's now recognized by many as a significant player in this market. iServer, which is designed to run in conjunction with a range of Microsoft and other collaboration and documentation tools, supports multiple notations and methods, offering accelerators for various popular standards. IT organizations interested in modernizing their approaches to enterprise architecture and IT governance are advised to investigate the IT for IT standards initiative and to consider iServer as a route to automating the use of IT for IT.